was 16 in real life, I was also about 16 in wherever I am when I sleep. I was walking along the sidewalk next to the basketball courts in Belmar. We used to skate there back in the day. There's usually an eight foot fence that separates the basketball courts from the sidewalk and the street, but it wasn't there. It's probably the middle of day, it's a nice day, and there's a normal amount of cars going up and down the streets. And I'm walking on the sidewalk towards the train tracks and all of a sudden, I see a car come from around the corner in front of me followed by a police car with the lights and sirens going. The car was like an old 80s Toyota Corolla or something. They both come whizzing around the corner right towards me. They zoom past me and the Corolla whips around behind me and drives onto the basketball courts and stops. A guy jumps out and grabs me, puts his arm around my neck and puts a gun to my head. While he's doing that, the cop jumps out of his car, pulls his gun and aims it at me and the guy who's holding me hostage. I mean, this happens in like seconds. Some maniacs got me in a chokehold with a gun to my head. The cop is like 10 to 15 yards away pointing his gun at us and the situation is fucking tense. It happens so quick that no other pedestrians or cars have even stopped to see what's going on yet. So the cop says loudly, put the gun down. The crazy guy holding me says nothing. He's just holding me tightly. He's strong and his nerves shake us both. And I really don't even have time to think of what I can do if I can even do anything. There is just fear and confusion. I'm just staring at the cop like, what the fuck is happening? And then all of a sudden, everything goes completely white. The whitest white I have ever seen. I could feel the white. It was the purest white accompanied by a warmth and peace. And slowly, the whiteness turns to distorted colors that gradually get clearer and clearer as I'm becoming more and more aware that my eyes are opening and I finally wake up in my bed on my back looking at the walls of my bedroom. Shit. It is at this point when I fully comprehend that I was shot in the head and killed in my dream. I died in my dream and woke up into my current reality. I didn't hear a gunshot. I didn't see or feel or hear anything. I just remember a cop pointing his gun at me and some crazy guy holding a gun to my head. And then everything turned white. The fucking guy must have shot me. I died and woke up into my life. This is what taught me that we never really die. We just wake up in other realities. Some form of reincarnation, more or less. I was always scared to death of death up until this dream. Paralyzed by the fear of what happens after you die. Now I know that I don't exactly know what's going to happen, but it never ends. And that brings me a tremendous amount of comfort. Because now I remember. We always wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up.